Hi everyone, welcome back to developers introduction to data science. So let's learn together what is model interpretability and how we can use model interpretability toolkits for our machine learning and data science solutions. So um, interpretability is uh, critical for data scientists, but also auditors and business decision makers uh, to ensure compliance uh, with the company's policies, industry standards, and government regulations. As you can see here, I list uh, three different categories that I think are very, very interested in using uh, model interpretability to explain their machine learning models. So these are data scientists because they need the ability to explain their models to executive or to other stakeholders, customers, so that they can understand the value and the accuracy of their fundings. We have legal auditors. They for sure require tools to validate models with respect to uh, regulatory compliance and monitor how models decisions are impacting other people. Uh, finally, business decision makers, they need a sort of a peace of mind by having the ability to provide the transparency for end users. So this uh, allows them to earn and maintain uh, trust. In Azure Machine Learning, we have uh, different uh, interpretability classes uh, that you can see here. For example, we have the Azure ML dot explain dot model. This is the main package that contain, uh, contains uh, functionalities supported by Microsoft. We have the Azure ML dot contribute dot explain dot model. This is a preview and is uh, experimental fun functionalities that you can try. Uh, finally, we have also the Azure ML dot train auto ML dot um, auto ML explainer. This is a package for understanding and explaining your automated machine learning models. Uh, using these uh, different classes and methods in SDK, you can explain model prediction, you can achieve uh, model interpretability, which is very important, and you can use uh, uh, interactive visualization. So let's uh, see what I mean with the interactive visualizations. We have uh, two different types of uh, visualization. Uh, we have a uh, global visualization. Uh, for example, the following uh, plots uh, provide an overall, uh, overall overview of the train model along with its uh, predictions and explanations. And uh, in terms of plots, you can use them for data exploration, global importance, explanation exploration, summary, and so on. And then uh, we have what we call the local visualizations. Uh, you can load the individual feature importance plot for any data point by clicking on any of the individual data points in uh, different uh, plots. As you can see in terms of the uh, plots, uh, we have uh, the local importance, uh, perturbation exploration, individual conditional expectations. So all of these are visualizations that allows you to understand better what your model is doing and why it's uh, predicting a specific type of uh, results. Uh, as I mentioned, interpretability is also available uh, for automated machine learning. In order to enable feature importance uh, for a train and sample model, you can use the explain underscore uh, model uh, function. And in order to enable uh, feature importance for each individual run prior to training, you can set the model underscore explainability parameter to true in your uh, AutoML config object, along with uh, providing the validation data. So this is, again, very important uh, if you want to use a different interpretability toolkits uh, with your uh, machine learning and automated machine learning uh, models. To learn uh, more, you can uh, go to aka.ms slash model interpretability.